Okay, hi guys. Now I intentionally misaligned the car from the garage, and I'm gonna use a key fob to use feature summon and see if it can successfully park into the garage with auto steering to avoid the, the alignment issue. Okay, so I'm gonna press this until it blinks. Okay. Then use the trunk button to make it go backwards. Will it be able to? Okay, it has noticed the obstacle. Will it go? No, it's not able to handle this if it's like this. It's not able to handle it. Okay. Now we know your limitation. Hi guys. So last time I told you that you cannot invoke uh, summon with key for Model X, and that has been proven to be wrong. I was checking the release notes of the current firmware, and it said that you can use the key, but you have to change the setting. So I'm gonna show you how to change the setting later, but. Right now, I'm going to show you how to use the key fob to uh, do the summon. So I'm in the parking lot right now, and uh, to summon the car forward, I need to press the center of the car until it blinks, like this. Press the front. As you see, it's coming to me. It's gonna go until it detects uh, the obstacle in the front. Come on. Yeah, stop, stop, stop. Okay, I didn't do anything. Ah. Okay. Now I'm gonna uh, summon to go backwards to the parking space, okay? So, press it. And this time I'm gonna press the trunk key. Okay, I should show you the key fob that to show you that I'm not doing anything with it right now. You see that car is backing up. Hey, hey, don't go off the cliff. There was a cliff there. Stop. Yep. I got that a success. I didn't fall off the cliff. Let's see what's gonna happen if it goes forward. Ooh. You won't want to know. You don't want to know. Okay. Uh, it's doing a good job. Uh, like it? Thanks for watching. Hi guys, so I'm gonna show you how to um, change the settings so that you can invoke summon with your key phone. So basically you need to go to controls here to call out this window and go to settings and you got to driver assistance just like this and um, go to customize. So if you watch my previous video you see that here require continuous press I was using yes so when you're using yes and you use the key fob it doesn't work because for key fob it's only one click so uh, if you expect the car is expecting you to use continuous control to uh, during the process of summon the key fob will not be able to do that so what you're gonna do is that you switch this to no so I'll give you a notice saying that you still need to take care during the process and you say yes changing this to no and then you can use the key fob to do the uh, summon like either forward or backward okay so that's how you do it thanks so my name is Terry uh, if you like our video please uh, click subscribe and uh, we're gonna see you at the next video see you